Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Access. In this module, I want to show you how you can create a catalogue of stock using a Microsoft Access report. So on the screen, I've got a finished article of what I wanted to create, basically what each item is, some description, the price, the author, and a picture of the manual or book. So that's what I want to recreate. So I'll just close this one down. And what I've got open here, I'll just close that one down. This table, books, is a stock table, stock list. It's got all the books, the author, the costs, quantities, etc., etc., and a link to where the photograph of this cover is. So this is how you have to do this. So this is just a text field, and then there's the path to where it is on my computer. And they're all JPEGs. And then what you can do is use a frame to pick up this picture so it comes into your report. So I'll just leave that open for a minute. And then I want to create a report design. Get myself a blank report and just go onto the data area to select that table. Drop that down. So it's going to be the TBL books is what I want to link to. Then I can go to the existing fields so that then lists the fields now it's just a case of laying out exactly how you want this to be now to get the photo if I bring that photo field on which is where that information is the, the book covers it comes on like this and if I go into view it's just going to give me the path from the table so it's just basically repeating that that there I don't want that at all so what you have to do is go back into design and get rid of that delete that one you have to use these report design tools controls drop that down and the one you need is this one an image so you click on that and you draw an image box this comes up and it's looking for an image so you just close that down cancel that off and you go to the property sheet this is still active and the control source for this is photo and then you have a look and then those photos come through now if I go back into design and can go on to properties because uh, not property your yeah, properties I want the the border on this to be a bit tighter than that so you've got border style transparent so let's change that to solid and thicker than hairline so let's put that to two points have a quick look that's good and back into design now I can move all this up to so there's no not a load of slack and now it's a case of putting the rest of the information on so I want the title I don't need the label so I'll just put the title I'll sort this out in a second I want the author don't want that get rid of that push that up and the cost push those on get rid of the label then just highlight these three go to arrange and pick stacked and then that will stack that like so let's have a quick look so we'll go back to report design have a look that's all right all nice and neat I don't want these lines around it so let's go back design still highlighted go to property sheet and we're on the borders again so Border style is solid, no border, transparent, um, border width, hairline, that should be okay, let's have a look, that's it, it's got rid of it. So then you've got your information and you've got a picture, so you basically created a catalogue of all the items that you have in your access table. And the key to all of this, to be honest, is getting this path right and making sure that the folders that contain your photographs don't shift around people don't move things and delete things because if you if you do move it you will lose this um, this path and then it won't come up with anything it'll just be a blank um, if i go into the form for this you can do the same thing with the form it's the same image 
going to design on this form you've got that same image box and if you look at the properties it's got the same thing there so it's just going to show you that and the only thing I haven't got on this one is um, I haven't done the border um, backstyle border color Border style. Let's just put that on there to make this look slightly different so you can actually see it. And then I quite like this two point size. Let's have a look. Yeah, that looks a little bit better. So it's, it, gives, it just puts a frame around it. Okay, so that was how you do it on a form. And a main focus is, I will save that, is the report that I've just created that you're creating a catalogue of stock in this case from your database with a nice little image of each item in your database. So hopefully that was of use. Thank you for your time and I'll see you on the next one.